Whenever Dundee is mentioned in Nigeria, the first thing that comes to mind is, of course, Dundee United, one of our most famous football clubs. I won't talk about that. I'll talk about one of Dundee's other great strong connections to Nigeria that many people still remember today. And that's Mary Slessor, who went from Dundee in the 19th century to do lots of great missionary work in Calabar. And she, hers is a name that is still recognized today, both in Nigeria and here in Dundee. At the center of our redeveloped waterfront, we have Slessor Square, which pays homage to, to the great achievements that she made. Dundee has become a much loved second home to generations of Nigerians over the last 50 years. They've been attracted by the warmth of the people, the quality of the education, and indeed by Scotland itself and its history and its magnificent landscapes. The education that they've received at the University of Dundee has enabled them to achieve great professional success, both when they return home to Nigeria, or indeed if they stay in the United Kingdom or go further afield. So a partner of mine, um, Olushe Aoro, He's my mentor in the International Tax and Legal Unit of, of Deloitte. So he went to University of Dundee and he had so much amazing things to talk about Dundee. So I told myself I definitely must go there. What I really like about Dundee really, it's, it's not so big, it's not so small. Coming from Nigeria, living in Dundee, I think um, I wouldn't be anywhere else really. If I had to go back home and haul my family back there, uh, starting all over again. Yeah, home is home, but uh, you know, we, we just, we're very comfortable here. The people are very friendly. It's just home for us. We just love it here, you know. Just that whole personal connection is just, um, it's really impressive. They're really open and welcoming. And uh, I really enjoy that. That made me feel, this is where I want to be. And I wouldn't mind coming back here and taking one of their jobs, by the way. So, <laughs> Most of the people who ask me about my UK experience really are more concerned about the um, career prospect and how how the Indians are and the quality of education. So on these three notes, I it's I will really say go for it. My experience has been wonderful. I feel that the course I'm doing is going to really help me for my career progression and also the Indians are really nice. So I'll say go for it. And let me also use the analogy of the Scottish Haggis. The UK experience is just like Scottish Haggis. You can never understand it until you experience it, or in the case of the Scottish Haggis, with some pepper dough, eat it. Mm -hmm.